Space Explorers Between the Lines. Three, two, one, go! With Archimedes in blue and Curie in red, this is a huge match. Archimedes had a tie early on, so a win is a big deal for this alliance. Checking out red first, some hatch panels being installed nice and early during the sandstorm. It does look like two cargo were sealed in. That adds 20, rather 10 points to the red alliance score. That is a tight score so far. Slight red alliance lead 31 to 28. The Blue Alliance is right away getting to work. Celtech on our Blue Alliance. They are the Alliance captain. They're either grabbing a hatch panel from their human player behind the glass. It looks like their elevator may move on up to level two to install two more points for that Blue Archimedes Alliance. Back for Curie on red. Plenty of cargo being dropped in behind some null hatch panels that were left in place during the sandstorm. The robot working on that for red is Robo Jackets. Their alliance partner, Cyber Knights, dropping off some cargo and hatch panels. They are working on a rocket on their own. They move their attention to the rocket on the other side of the field. It looks like the intent is to push away the defensive Runnymede robotics. Runnymede now is a little bit out of the way. Southington able to swivel their manipulator around wherever they need it. And Cyber Knights drop off three more points for the Red Alliance, 56 to 44. Maquanago Bears in blue bumpers. They are facing defense on behalf of the Force team. The Force team now is sticking to Maquanago. We previously saw them paying attention to other robots earlier. They are an excellent defensive robot for the Curie Red Alliance. Maquanago and their partner Celtex, they drop off six points simultaneously with cargo into their cargo ship. There are several bays still open for Celtech, the captain of that Blue Alliance. McQuanago trying to reach up to level two. They are able to do it despite defense from the force team. The Blue Alliance now tied up with red here on the 10th round Robin Einstein match. 35 at 38 Robo Jackets, three more points for the Red Alliance. That Blue Alliance cargo ship looking nearly completely full, rather 100% full. Red almost there as well. Red leading by six points in the end game. We know that McQuanago and Runnymede can double climb. Let's check out the Red Alliance in our final moments. McQuanago is up 24 points. Final score coming up. The winner is the Blue Archimedes Alliance. They win 97 to 88. All right, that was a great match.